The rehearsal process has been quite liberating. We're just really in the beginning of really getting off book on these songs. <laughs> we need to stop and do some research right now. Um, what does gin taste like? You start to work on the lyrics and the music and then the emotion and you hope to get it all integrated together. It's horrifying. Every day it's terrifying. There are so many songs that like, I think when we're doing it, we're just trying to get the music down. So when you get it right, you feel like you're on top of the world. And I hope to get them all right before July 1st. Thank goodness we're a month away. <laughs> we're going to get a lot better. Oh, good. <laughs> good. Was that lower? For a second, no, 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 no. I'm thrilled to be music directing this with Dan. It's 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 our second second show together. Yeah. Second show? Is that all? Feels like we've been I working know, right? together for 35 <laughs> years. <laughs>got a great direction, a great team, and a wonderful cast. I had no idea who Jacques Brel was until Dan was like, I'm doing this show. And I found out that like so many of the artists, like David Bowie, Steely Dan, like these, these artists that I just loved, were influenced so heavily by him. And I was like, what was it about his music that spoke to these songwriters? If I had to describe the music of Jacques Brel, I would say that it's, um, it is visceral. Inspiring, existential. Cynical and witty and... Sweet, poetic. The music is sexy. It just <laughs> is. There's, I mean, every single song is layered with so many different harmonies and so many, again, like, just the slight lyrical changes. It's like, when it happens, it's like, oh, excuse me. There's a sort of undertone of optimism to all the songs that really drew me to the show and to the music. Brel was such a good identifier of what exists in human nature that makes us all the same. I feel like Jacques Brel is talking to me from the beyond. The music was written so long ago, but we realize how essential it is to understanding life. I mean, moments of like, I'm at home washing the dishes hours after rehearsal and a lyric, finally I get it, and I just start sobbing at the sink. I do think it, it, it addresses universal themes that are particularly apropos now. It almost feels like the songs were, were written uh, yesterday. And so to find out where you fall with what's happening in your lives and what the song is saying about it. I think it's important to explore the different aspects of life and I think that the show does a really good job of doing that.